So guys, let's take a look at this. The post is titled, Updates from the Systems Team. Let's see what they have to say for themselves, shall we? Okay, here we go. Hi everyone, today we want to talk to everyone about some team changes and our plans for balance going forward, as well as setting up some goals and expectations for the coming year. Let's get started. Well, that's uh, that's a, a good beginning. I'll give them that, you know, like the arena with the communication. Insane, right? I didn't see that one coming. So here we go. System team updates. Let's welcome Cal CMC Cohen as the new system team's competitive designer. Some of you may know him from his work on comparative content in QA or even as a comparative PvP player. Cal has displayed great aptitude for comparative balancing systems, making him a, new, uh, a great new additional to the overall team. Ben P will transition to a new role as design manager for Guild Wars 2. Ooh. That's, that's pretty interesting. That's big. That's big, guys. That is big, actually. That is huge. We'll always think of him as part of our team, but we look forward to seeing his continued success in his new role. Now, that's, I mean, well, uh, Ben is obviously a very trustworthy dev, and it is obviously, uh, you know, that he's not in charge of PvP again. I'm sure there's a, many a tear has been shed. Um, the, the main thing here is that, uh, that there is, I, I imagine, yeah, well, uh, CMC is obviously trusted by Ben. I would imagine he had a say in this. CMC's in chat. Right. There you go. CMC is in the chat. Ben P, CMC GW2, nice. So that is really, really cool. Um, mm. I'm sure it's going to work out completely fine. And, uh, but obviously, congratulations to uh, Ben for his, I assume that, uh, that sounds like a promotion to me, seeing as he's design manager of the entire game, right? Of the entire game. Now that, look, uh, that, uh, you know what? Okay. Uh, maybe I'm a little biased. But that does fill me with confidence. It does, actually. Um, it does. I think, I, I know, I trust Ben completely uh, in this role. I'm not, I'm not, I think it's kind of like a, a new thing. It's like a, like a new thing. I don't think he's replacing anyone or anything like that. But yeah, I have complete faith in Ben. And hopefully we can see his, you know, his tendrils throughout the entire game now. I think he has a very good understanding of Guild Wars 2 in general. Uh, and he'll be able to do a very, uh, very good job there. Now, like, I and do a hope... good approach that... to the community as well. Yes. Yeah, this is huge. Like, Ben has been such a... With that, look, guys, and look, I know he's here in the chat, so obviously I'm going to be nice, right? Okay? Or am I? Okay? Yeah. Uh, unironically, without Ben, the PvP scene would have suffered a massive amount. Okay, and that's not just because of his, you know, his determination in pushing the competitive game modes in Guild Wars 2, right? It's also the fact that he talks to people and he's been engaging with the community, um, you know, unofficially, right? Like, this is not part of his job description, right? But all this time, he's actually been going the extra mile and uh, trying to engage with the community. And to be frank, that, that overall is a, it was a massive contribution to the PvP and competitive scene in Guild Wars 2, the ailing scene as it were, and, and honestly, like, w without him, you wouldn't have stuff like the monthly AT gizmo, all that sort of stuff, right? It's really, uh, I don't know, it, you know, it really is, um, uh, it, we, we, we were really lucky to have him, but he's not, he's not going, he's still here, he's design manager now, okay? I know he's up there, and he's gonna be up there in the, in the, in the ivory tower angels, he's not gonna talk to the likes of us plebs yep. anymore. <laughs> <laughs> um, but you know, he'll be over there. Yep. He'll be watching over us, okay? And, and that that's good enough for me, right? That's good enough for me. Hopefully, he still but he's comes got the stick. He's got the stick. So if CMC yeah. gets a little bit out Ooh. of line, oh, it's gonna come. Oh wow, <laughs> he's gonna. Yeah. Oh, oh dear. Ooh, I'm a little bit scared now. Uh, I hope he doesn't. <laughs> hope he's not gonna. He's not gonna beat us with the you know with, with the goddamn stick right here. There you go. Oh, so let's uh, continue along with this uh, post now. Uh, here we go. Skills and balance. Balance is important to the entire game. In the past, we've split skill changes between the three core game modes, PvP, PvE, and World vs. World. Previously, skill designers oversaw all balance changes with sign-off from, sign from designers working on competitive content. PvE balance will remain in the hands of skills designers, but PvP and World vs. World balance... Oh, oh, dude. Angels, yes. 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 Oh. <laughs> you know when yeah. I when I when I heard this, I was like, mm. 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 yeah. You know, we, that just filled, yeah. just filled me with like a warmth yeah. inside me. It was like, ah, oh, you know. Yeah. It was it was a mixture of relief and just gratitude. <sighs> you know, just oh. PvP and World versus World balance will now be handled by competitive designers. Finally. 
okay, for so yeah. long that PvP, <laughs> PvP and World vs. World have, have been, like, shackled to, like, a, a team, look, and with all due respect here, that focuses on roleplay over actual balance and fun, <laughs> okay, that has been going on for far <laughs> too long and now they actually might be able to make world versus world playable and pvp a hell of a lot more fun so th this is oh Out with this, the role this, players dude, in with the pvp this is so good ah oh, what a what a glorious line of text to read holy shit incredible yeah. <laughs> oh that's fantastic uh yo just are uh, yeah better late than never am i right better late than never right you know what i'm saying yes. boys okay yes. uh it's it's been a while but now we're in the mix we're in play and it feels good this will give our comparative focus team members a bit more control over how players interact with their content and it will allow the skills designers to focus on pve balance and other systems works so it just seems like it's going to be more efficient overall really uh, by the sounds yep. of that anyway um and hopefully you can we can see more aggressive balance patches we can see more frequent balance patches yeah th this is really good it's incredible actually I, yeah uh, hats yeah. off to Arena. This is a massive, massive post. And, uh, I, I, you know, like the communication is absolutely there. And look, like the fact that, well, uh, you know, we see CMC already actually in Twitch chat. Um, yeah, that's a lot of confidence for the future there as well with regards to commun communication. And, of course, the next paragraph, guys, as well. Communication. Balance changes for the different game modes are a type of content we feel comfortable discussing with the community before release. Oh, yeah! As a team, we want to increase our presence on the forums and be more open about upcoming changes to get feedback early. Yes! Like, oh, dude, we're, they're, we're, we're, look, we're, we're teaching them, Angels. Like, next step is going to be a PTR, dude, okay? It's going to happen. Yep. They're going to do yep. a fucking PTR, right? It, there's, we're going to be in the mix. Um, yeah. So, yeah, yeah, again, this is really good. Like, because sometimes, and, and this is not an arena. I'm not criticizing arena for this. This happens with literally every competitive game. Sometimes the game developers put a balance change into the game, right? And it has an unintended consequence. If you've got loads of greasy nerds who play the game every single day, eight hours a day, right? Then they will probably spot the issue um, that maybe a developer or, or someone on the team might overlook. Just, a, you know, a fresh pair of eyes, that sort of thing. This is huge, right? So, um, yeah, getting feedback on changes early will... It, you might be able to prevent something, like, from Condi Thief and Star 3 from ever existing, right? And you know what? That that will be a big thumbs up from me. So, yeah, yeah, this is this is really good. I, I mean, it, I the only thing is I think they would need to... Um, I really hope that they would extend that uh, to expansions, right? I, I really don't want another Path of Fire when you've got Scourge doing 60k DPS on launch, right? Um, and also, you nothing know... Nothing wrong with that, dude. Yeah, there's nothing, nothing wrong with Scourge. Right. Yeah. Do, do you remember uh, Scourge in PvP on launch? Like, the shades oh, stacking? Dude, uh, dude, like, I don't know which was more cancer. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Spellbreaker or Scourge? Like, I, have no, I, can't, um, I, I can't work it out, to you, be honest. You know, as much as I, I you know... As I think Necro is the god class, I think that Spellbreaker was like, more degenerate. Like, you could like, actually like, 1v4 yes. people, right? I mean, it was. Yes, I mean, you could. Like, they couldn't kill you because full counter was on what, like, four second yeah. cooldown or something? Yeah, that's shit. good. Yeah, like, it was seconds. ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, communication continues. In the future, we'll also begin calling out specific times when some of us will be present on the forums to collect feedback through targeted threads. Oh, wow. It's like Reddit AMAs, except actually it's on the forums. That's good. Oh, man. Did Guild Wars 2, ArenaNet are gamers. Ben P and CMC are gamers. Mark my words, guys, okay? They are video game players. Nice. Okay. Ultimately, we want to be more open and available to the community. And we ask that in return, you help provide constructive feedback and respectful discussion. <laughs> well, I mean, the PvP community might not be the best place for that. But you know what, guys? Seriously, be nice to the devs, you, you little shits. Okay? Come on. Um, you know, they're, they're, they're opening the door, a little crack after, you know, long years of silence. So show some goddamn respect and do your best to actually be nice. I completely agree with them here. Um, just because you really, really hate a, a particular build doesn't mean you can be a dickhead about it, right? Okay? You gotta, you gotta, you gotta be respectful and constructive. Because, guys, ultimately, if you go in, start going crazy, and you're flaming everyone, you're flapping your arms about all over the place, going crazy, um, 
then, it, you know, it's only going to screw you over, right? It's only going to fuck you over in the long run because the devs aren't going to listen to you because they think you're a degenerate and, you know, your balance change isn't going to come through. So respectful, constructive, and don't just say something, um, you know, for no reason because you just don't like the build. You've got to actually have a legitimate critique, right? You've got to, you, you can't just say, oh yeah, I think Mesmer should be deleted from the game, right? That's not good enough, guys, right? I mean, a lot of people would agree with that, but, you know, you've got to say why and you've got to say how you would do it, you know? Oh, we should just, you know, they can't dodge Delete anymore. It. Okay. So, let's recap. Let us I recap. Like, I like this bit. There are some changes to the skills team, a uh, system team rather, as people move into new roles. Skills designers will continue to own balance changes for PvE. Competitive designers will now own balance changes for PvP and World vs. World. And the system team now uh, plans to be more active on the forums. We'll talk to you soon. The Guild Wars 2 systems team. Wow, I cannot wait to see the result of this. I mean, I would imagine we'll see it in the next balance patch, which will pro- wait. The next balance, I want to say it will actually be next year at this point? I'm seeing a lot of people like, and I saw it on Reddit as well, a lot of people going like, you know, I don't believe this. CMC is a good guy, like most of you won't probably have seen a lot of his work, but he has been very communicative, um, and yeah, I think it's I think it's the real deal. Hmm. Yeah, uh, I I think that yeah, you you could you could definitely make the argument that some people might not um you know might not believe this because they have seen it before. There have been restructurings before, and it didn't really do anything. However, you know what? I have complete confidence um, in this team, and this sounds really good. The communication sounds great as well. I think this is a bit of a new thing. I don't think we've ever really had any kind of really open. Uh, open door to the community like this before so yeah i don't know i think this is actually a, a really really big announcement and i think people should at least give them uh, at least give it a chance uh see what comes of it right you know because well i think everyone is pretty desperate right now people really want to see this stuff a lot of famous last words here's the thing guys right you know it's um it's like the opposite of the the boy who cried wolf dude like no one believes him but then again you know it eventually happens there you go easy mm. right it's the wolf who cried boy that's what it is dude <laughs> Yes. I wouldn't be surprised if we saw something in the coming weeks. Yeah. Oh, you, you, uh, well, I, I, I know that there are actually going to be some um, adjustments to Big Shade. I, well, I mean, I, that's what I've heard anyway. That Well, well I mean, no, they've they, said they, that. They, they said, and yeah, Condi Thief. And Condi, Condi Thief. And probably Staff Thief as well. Um, we'll probably yeah, see imagine, uh, yeah. some, some changes there as well because, well, they deserve it. Um, so yeah, I think I'll see some micro changes, but honestly, like, this, this hypes me up for the next balance patch, though. Because I think they're going to be able to mm. just go crazy. They're just going to be unleashed, you know? <laughs> that it's, it's Ben Unchained. That's what it is, dude, okay? It's, <laughs> it's going to be big. Yeah. No, 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 no. Sorry, CMC Unchained. CMC Unchained, yeah. We've got we to gotta be, we be real now. That's true, know? that's true, we're, we're placing our We're placing our faith in CMC now. Yeah. Like, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. that's what we got to do. It's going to be big. He's going like, to beat, start beating his chest like, like a gorilla. Except it's in the balance. He's gonna like he's gonna like pound all the overpowered specs down, dude. It's gonna be great. Yeah, that's big.